This video explores one of the most important but often misunderstood concepts in physics, which has implications for various phenomena, from molecular collisions to large-scale weather patterns. It is a concept that governs the entire evolution of the universe, from its inception to its eventual end. Furthermore, it may determine the direction of time and even play a role in the existence of life itself. To grasp the confusion surrounding this topic, the video poses a simple question, what does the Earth receive from the Sun? The participants in the video offer various answers, including light rays, heat, warmth, vitamin D, and energy. They recognize that the Earth receives a significant amount of energy from the Sun on a daily basis. However, when asked how much energy the Earth radiates back into space relative to the energy it receives from the Sun, the participants are unsure. Some suggest it could be less, around 70% or 20%, while others acknowledge that the Earth uses some of the energy it receives. The video then delves into the concept of energy and its characteristics. It emphasizes that energy cannot be used up or destroyed, it only transforms from one form to another. The participants speculate that the Earth must radiate back a similar amount of energy to maintain a balance, preventing it from overheating. The video highlights the historical context by discussing the story of Sadi Carnot, a 17-year-old student during the invasion of France in 1813. Carnot's interest in steam engines led him to study the efficiency of heat engines. He envisioned an ideal heat engine, known as Carnot's engine, which operates with no losses and no friction. He discovered that the efficiency of such an engine depends solely on the temperatures of the hot and cold sides. Lord Kelvin, inspired by Carnot's engine, realized that it could serve as the foundation for an absolute temperature scale. The concept of absolute zero emerged from this, representing the point at which all molecular motion stops. Kelvin proposed that an engine operating between absolute zero and a high temperature source could achieve 100% efficiency. The video introduces the concept of entropy, first described by Rudolf Clausius. Entropy measures the dispersal or spread out nature of energy. As energy spreads and becomes more dispersed, it becomes less available to perform useful work. Clausius formulated the first two laws of thermodynamics, stating that the energy of the universe is constant, but the entropy tends to increase, leading to the spread of energy over time. Entropy is often associated with disorder or randomness, but the video suggests thinking of it as the tendency of energy to spread out. This concept explains why heat flows from hot to cold and why certain processes are irreversible. While it is theoretically possible for heat to flow from cold to hot, it is highly improbable. With larger systems containing trillions of atoms, such occurrences are virtually non-existent. The video addresses the question of how structure and organization persist on Earth despite the tendency of energy to spread out. The answer lies in the sun, which continuously provides a stream of low entropy, concentrated energy. Plants capture this energy through photosynthesis, converting it into sugars. Animals consume plants, transferring and utilizing the energy for their own needs. However, at each step, the energy becomes more dispersed. In summary, the video explores the concept of energy and entropy, highlighting their significance in understanding various physical phenomena. It emphasizes the role of the sun in providing concentrated energy to sustain life on Earth, despite the ever-increasing tendency of energy to spread out. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more fascinating insights into the world of science and physics. Stay curious. Shot, end card with channel logo and a call to action to subscribe and follow.